this thing is nice. You just kick back. Let me get my phone out. Watch this. Ann's gonna come in here. But let's keep on moving. More crafting stuff. Lots of crafting stuff. Cards. What is that? Craft bond glue. I don't know exactly what it is, but some kind of a crafting thing. There's a box there that it just looks like it's got like crafting scrapbook type stuff in it. Here's some cling. I haven't looked down in there. Probably pots and pans. There is a lid for a crock pot. And then it looks like we got some fall stuff in here. Or a wooden watermelon. That's something she made. This is fall. This is, you can tell us something that they painted. Nice little pumpkin thing. And man, it smells good in here because look at this thing. Um, what is it? Falling leaves. It smells really good. We've got some other fall stuff in here. Let me get that back in. And once again, I know I say this in a lot of videos. And I've been saying this one, but nice containers because con containers will add up. Sometimes you'll make enough money on the containers to pay for the whole, I and mean, you'll make money just on containers, pay for the unit and then some a lot of times. All right, and here we got party supplies, it looks like. Tablecloths, napkins, fancy, elegant, entertaining, like the pl plastic stuff. Um, all kinds of stuff, little, then we got, this is crafting stuff, but packs of like, uh, okay, that's a table cover, like for a party. Silverware crafting stuff it's um what is this invitations little flip-flop invitations what is this right here artist palettes got this the little paint paint thing with the brush christmas napkins so all kinds of party supplies there it'll sell not my favorite thing to get but it will sell and now this is the thing that's wrapped up in a tarp looks like some kind of piece of furniture that i don't really know that was nice Okay, it's okay. I see what it is. It's one of these, it's a shelf that has all the little plastic bins. I'm wondering if it's full of the bins are full of stuff, and that's why they put the top over it. Yep. Oh my goodness. Here, let me um. I'm gonna go ahead and just unhook the straps for just a minute, so we can look in here. It's full of looks like paint supplies and all that stuff. Holy crap. Look at this. Tons of Sharpies. I mean, ton, look at all these markers. It's a brand new chalk marker. That's a lot of money in markers. Sharpies, highlighters. Man. Um, glue guns. Bennett. I don't know what's in here. Let's see. Highlighters, pens, Sharpies. Um, we got wipes, we got hair dryers, stapler, tape, tons of paint brushes. Look at all these paint brushes. Tons and tons of them. Tons of paint brushes. Good lord, at the paint brushes. Uh, there's more paint brushes. Man, I mean, it's an unreal amount of paint brushes. They were definitely into the crafting. That's a nice DeWalt tape measure there. Um, glue guns, we got more paint. I mean, we've already had so much paint in this unit, it's unreal. Um, scissors. What's in here? Little wood pieces for crafting wood stars and all that. So, lots of paint brushes, lots of markers, and some other stuff. But the, the the actual organizer itself here is really nice. All right, the amount of crafting stuff is just unreal. One, two, three, four, five of these plastic organizers. This one's smashed in. Okay, never mind. Okay, four of them there are full of acrylic paint for the most part. This one is. It's actually full of medicine. Look at all this. My gosh. I mean, full of medicine. There's a... Um, well, that's like a brand new thing of... It's full of dishwashing detergent. Some cleaning rags. And vitamins. But look, there's some nice dish towels. We got, we got the vitamins. We got zinc. Fire starter. So, some other stuff mixed in. But lots of... um medicine type stuff in there sheets and towels 
all that kind of stuff. What is this? This one's got the food in it. We got spaghetti noodles. Let's see what a, a date is, just to kind of see about how old this is. All right, this is from 2018. So the food is definitely old. And that's noodles and different stuff like that. That stuff has been out of date for four years now. Yes, 2018 has been four years ago. And that seems like it was just yesterday. It's a heavy little box. We got dishes in here. China. Yeah, looks like another China set here. China. Yep, that's what it is. It's all just with padding in between. That's why it was so heavy because it's full of china. Going back here to this area. This one's a light container, so this one's not going to be china. What do we have? Insulin pump. It's new. It's all wrapped up. This is okay. This does have a date on it. Which is a little bit past the date, 521, May 21st, 2022. But I wonder, I mean, I don't know. I think people might still be able to use them. I don't know for sure. That one, February of this year. And then what do we have here? Dex, Dexcom. Does this have a date on it? I don't think this has an expiration date. Is this like some kind of some kind of monitor diabetes monitor maybe I'm not really 100% Dexcom G5 mobile receiver kit I think it might have something to do with diabetes and we got what is this some kind of some kind of sensors I don't know um, one touch and then Dexcom sensor kit okay that's the same thing that's in those so all kinds of Dexcom that I believe mobile platinum sensor kit now that one has an expiration date on it so some of this has dates on it some of it doesn't this thing right here don't know what that's worth but it doesn't have an expiration date because it's the actual electronic part but some of the tubes and stuff have expiration dates but i think pretty sure that's like diabetic supplies of some sort and right here okay we've got the metal trash cans and they're really heavy there's got to be something in them there's two cans one lid here on the top I wonder if there's another lid i think that's like for a dog put the dog bowls on there it's pretty nice. Oh, that's nice. And what is this? Firewood? <laughs> yep, yeah, we got some firewood in here. I bet that stuff will probably burn right up. It's been in those cans in here. It's probably extremely dry. And then we got a couple things. Mulch color renewal. Okay, so you spray this on your mulch once it's faded and it brings the color back. I don't, I've, I've not seen that before. I mean, it makes sense because I've seen faded mulch. But I didn't know that was an actual thing that you could buy. Of course, this thing's not gonna, probably not gonna go back in there correctly. Not. So, let's just take that out. It's gonna be an All right, so another section here in the middle that we've pretty, pretty much looked at everything through. But now we got this whole Basically another like 10 by 10 area here with a lot of boxes, containers, everything. Oh, look, we got one of these. Oh crap, something just fell over. We got one of these nice, oh, this is really nice. Nice and clean. One of these zero gravity chairs. I got one of these I take camping with me and this, this thing is nice. You just kick back, let me get my phone out. Watch this, Ann's gonna come in here. So yeah, you, you can just kick all the way back in this thing. 
all the way to the point it feels like you're going to tip over backwards almost. Alright, what fell over? Look at this. This is nice. One of those little sandwich signs. Welcome home, Dad. But nice little chalkboard sandwich sign. Alright, we're going to get some of this loaded up now like we did before and then we will move on to this section here. Let's look up this cooler, the Pelican Elite Cooler 50 Quart. On their website, the Pelican website is $329.99, so a $330 cooler. And like I said, it's in excellent shape. I mean, when you open the inside, I really don't think it's ever been used. It's just, you know, they're so clean and there's no debris or dirt anywhere, even like in the seams or the hinges. But All right, we got this section left here. See what kind of treasures we're going to find. We got a picture of a chandelier. <laughs> All right, the Paul Pell Waste Station. Is it here? Pet Waste Station. It looks like it is here. Filters, whether it's in intact or working, I don't know. Now we got a nine foot Christmas tree box. Is that what's in here? Yep. You can tell a Christmas tree, it makes a certain noise <laughs> when you move it around. All right, here's the box. It has some Georgia stuff in it. Oh, it's actually, I think it's Georgia Christmas stuff here. Georgia snowman ornament. Georgia, okay, that was a Georgia bag that was right there. I'll have to look at some of this. I might keep a couple of things. Here's a Georgia Santa hat. Here's some kind of an ornament. I've already got a whole lot of Georgia ornaments already. A nice little glass ball Georgia one. Um, do we have any other ornaments? Looks like there's a Georgia ornament. Here's another one, another glass one. Some of these can be pretty, pretty pricey on these, you know, glass ornaments like this. $25. And then we got the Georgia, oh, this is a cool ornament, but it's a little birdhouse. It says Go Dogs on it. Sunday Buffet, Razorback Salad, Gamecock Stew, Gator Tail, Elephant Ears. That's funny. That's definitely there. I don't have one like that. I've got several of the, the different glass balls. Scented Candle, here is First Frost. Let's see what a First Frost smells like, maybe, according to this candle company. Um, yeah, I mean, I don't really, it doesn't really smell like what I would think first frost. It smells good. I don't even know how to describe a first frost. It's kind of, you know, when it, you go out and it's cold in the morning, it has kind of a distinct smell sometimes. A lot of times it'll kind of smell like wood burning because people will have, you know, people might have a fire going, but. More Christmas stuff. Oh, we got the elf on the shelf in here. We got a little Christmas tree, and then, oh look, this is cool. Some of her artwork she did, she did Christmas. Oh, well Santa Claus. So we got snowman, oh, Anne's wanting Santa Claus. This is kind of cool. It's a snowman yeah. nose, like looking straight up with a snowflake on it. Yeah. We got a church. Oh, so is this going to be churches now? Church. Yeah. Another snowman. We got a single red ornament in the tree. We got a reindeer with lights tangled up. And then we got a fall in love, a fall one. So no Santa yet. And we won't find them because look, there's a whole bunch. I think those, I think those are all new ones there. Mm -hmm. But do we need to leave this out? Maybe put some of them in it. Um, so maybe you want to set. We can set yeah. it up there. Yeah, I think these are all new right here. Yep, these are all blank. Oh gosh, all blank canvases. Those are all blank? Yeah, these are all blank canvases. Mm hmm Whole bunch of them. Yeah. Yeah, they, their art is pretty good. Sometimes we get get people stuff and it's really not very good. <laughs> yeah. It's just a bunch of weird weirdness, but she did a pretty good job. Clothing. Yep, clothing. That might maybe dirty clothing, I don't know. Because it's kind of just thrown in there. It's another one of these miniature tables. I don't know what the exact purpose of such a small table is. 
I mean, like I said, it almost looks like for a doll, for a kid to play with, but I don't know. There's all, all the painting cups. There's a little Plano organizer, wooden crate. Oh, God. My finger just bent back. There's a wooden, make a table out of it, make wall art with it. Anybody that's into arts and crafts, you would be loving this unit here. This is all, it looks like almost, there's like some back braces, but it looks kind of like the bags that you would put like clothes in. Like you'd put a nice dress in and look more paint. Tons of tons of paint. All right, this one right here in the front. Everybody, you've probably seen this as I've been going by it, but it's some very nice decor in it. Look at that right there. That's very nice. That's a toilet paper holder. Oh, look. We got a Ruger box, but there's nothing in it. But a Ruger gun box. It does have a gun lock in it. But of course, nothing in it. You find a lot of gun boxes in units. But every now and then you will find the gun so that you never know that she could have hidden the gun somewhere in there. It was for a Ruger semi-auto pistol, nine millimeter. We got the Adidas sweatshirt. It's kind of cool. I like this one. Um, <clears throat> I don't know. <laughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> I don't know what size it is. Do not know, but I might keep that. Let me set this to the side. It looks like it might be a hair too small for me though, but sometimes it's hard to tell. What kind of jersey is this? Oh, look at here. We got a Randy Moss jersey. This is a little bit older. I mean, obviously it's a Randy Moss, but it's a starter. Vikings Randy Moss jersey. It's in really good condition. I don't see any other jerseys from the looks of it, but the clothes overall look clean without really kind of digging down into all of them but that that jersey is a nice little nice little find what do we have here multi-green collagen it's all empty they used all of the collagen these are kind of, these are cool right here these are are these hanging some sort of hanging, yep, these are cool, look at these. There's two of them here, a hanging candle holder. Then we got different mugs and stuff in here. Whoa, want to drop that one. Let's see if that was a Yeti, it's not. It's, a, it's like an Ozark trail or something. Um, more nice decor down in here. Pumpkin candle. I'm telling you, if Leah was here, she'd be claiming all this. TV wall mount. See, Anne's here though, so Anne's gonna tell Leah about all this stuff. So I can't even hide it from Leah. See, she said she's gonna call her tonight and tell her so that I don't hide it from her. What is this? We got a couple, we have a couple rocks in the container. And as you can see, there's still, there's a, okay, there's a table, like a bar hack table. There is a chair. I don't know if there's two chairs for it. Large piece of art. I think this is the one that she did. Still quite a few boxes and everything. Oh, here's a TV. A little bit bigger TV. Bunches of boxes. Oh, look at this backpack right here. Jan Sport. This looks pretty nice. Oh, it's got a little bit of staining, but the Jan Sport backpack. Let's see what's in it. What are we gonna have? And we got more bags. More bags in the backpack. This has something in it. Remington and like a, some kind of a razor That's like a charging base for a razor. I don't really see the razor Maybe that is the razor. I don't know what this is some kind of a well, I guess it is the razor. It's just a look a little palm Palm razor I guess I don't know All right, 
ton of stuff in this unit. We just keep, and this has got lots, oh Lord. It looks like a lot of paperwork. Ugh, file stuff, that thing is heavy. Let's see if we can keep moving along, see if we can hit all this before we run out of space on the memory card. What do we have? What do we Oh, we got one of these weird pillows. That thing you just, it like, you just kind of fill it up with air. Weed be gone, but you like, kind of like, do like this and it fills up with air and then you lay on it. It's really crazy. I don't know. What else is down in here? Something in that box. I'll be surprised later on. See, here it is right here. Share the air. Looks like a big, like, banana kind of. You're just split open that you're kind of laying on here's more is this like the diabetic looks like diabetic type stuff auto soft infusion set something along those lines here's a brand new tarp look down there more of course more paint and everything Strasbourg Manor little cheap little wall clock there it's battery power all right we're full of books learning stuff we got the classic Charlotte's Web, Baskin Robbins, with what in it? It's like little learning cards. So books and learning stuff. There's another heavy, heavy container. Is it more paperwork? I don't know if it's paperwork, mister, but different books. Looks like a lot of learning books. I think they were probably um, at least homeschooling, if not maybe some sort of teacher. I'm finding a lot of learning learning books now. Paperwork files. That goes on. Just keep on digging, keep on digging. We got clothing. Oh we got an oh lord. Can't stand the Florida Gators, but I'll sell it. It's a brand new Florida Gator shirt. I don't know what that is couple other nice men's shirt this is the you know men's clothing now okay computer monitor big old metal like, planner bin I mean, definitely been plenty of nice decorative items in this unit we got a suitcase some purses decent little suitcase here's some more clothing and this looks like men's clothing okay so there was a man involved some way, some form. Cause his stuff's back here in the back. TV. Let's look right here. We got Christmas back in here. Look at that. That's a nice galvanized metal sleigh. Looks like a nice Christmas. More clothes. What else are we finding back here? Oh, we've got a grabber. We're almost done in. I'm almost done back here. Okay. The big old piece of art, like I said, I think this might be one that the, the owner of this unit did. Pretty good job if that's the case. Here's another one. This one's kind of cool. I wonder if this is one they did. That's pretty cool. Look at that. I think it may be. I think this is one the girl was pretty good. Pretty good at art. That's pretty nice right there. And here's another container like with all kinds of like really nice markers and art supplies look at those very nice look at all that dual brush pins dual brush pins very nice there there's another piece of art that's kind of cool it's, it's a goat look at that we're still digging over here um, household stuff we got hangers and hooks light bulbs cascade complete we got swiffer stuff 
We got Pledge Allergen Wipes. I just hit the camera, sorry. Looks like um, clothing and stuff here. More scrapbook stuff. Oh, look. You hungry? Here's some tortilla rounds. Tortilla chips. Best if used by June 28th, 2021. They're probably, they're supposed to be crispy anyway. You won't even notice. You won't even notice that they're still. I'm out here and I call in. She's just out here playing with this ball. I'm, on, I'm in there going through all the stuff. No, not really. Look at Anna in there. She's got this thing stacked up high and tight. Look at that wall. That's beautiful, Ann. Yeah, just don't breathe on it because it'll fall on you and, you'll, and I'll have to come get you out from underneath all that. But she's in here packing it high and tight. We're gonna start carrying all the rest of this out to her and get this thing finished off. All right, here's this rolling cooler that was in the back corner. This, I've gotten a lot of these coolers, but this is probably the nicest one that I've ever gotten. It's all stainless steel and it's got like heavy duty, a heavy duty base on it. And it's pretty much um, deeper that way than most of them are. And then of course inside that we got more paint. But let's see is this oh look right there there's like a um granite cutting board but in this box here let's check it out what do we have Ooh, maybe we might have some jewelry here we pulled this box out of the cooler here I, I think it might be some jewelry in here and we already found some gold and silver in another box so definitely gonna check and see okay here's yep let's see Here's a necklace, and it looks right off the bat like it's probably silver. And, well, maybe not after I said all that. I can't quite, and I don't see any mar markings on it, so it might not be. Okay, let's keep on looking here. Here's a whole container. Here's a key. Look, it's a Mickey Mouse key. I wonder what that, if that goes to something or what. I don't know. Lock on this box, is there? No. All right, this right here. What is this? What is this? I don't know exactly what that's for. Do you know? It's either for powder. It's too big to be pills, so it's probably some kind of something for makeup. Powder. There's like a little pad in there. Yep, you're probably probably powder. Yeah. It almost looks like it could be silver, but I don't okay. see any marking anywhere. Got earrings. I don't know. This might all be costume right here in this container. Looks like yes, yeah, some costume. Okay, let's keep looking. Is that an iPhone that you had there, Ann? Yep. Yep. There's an iPhone. Looks pretty decent shape. All right, let's go this way. There's a wallet. No money in it. No Checkbook. Oh, we've got lots of little earrings and stuff. Looks like there could be some silver in there. I mean, it'll have to be looked at closer. Earrings, you gotta look at really close. Those are the safety pins. Um, like buttons and pins. It's a little Halloween brace that it looks like. So we'll have to look at that closer and see. Hold that. Let's see. What is that? Oh, we got some of those long gloves. Yeah. Like for when you wanna dress up. Some little earrings but they're just costume what we got here is a nice looking necklace maybe maybe something maybe some pearls have to check out that later on lots of jewelry but so far it looks like a lot of costume as of right now Bad we didn't find any classrooms to go with all them diplomas. Yeah, <laughs> like I don't see any markings on that, like it may be silver. Um, looks like more costume. I mean, I could be overlooking stuff. We're just doing a quick look right here. There's a box down there. This looks like it could be silver right here. The box. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna set this stuff back down in there. This has the look. I think, oh, I see a, okay, yeah, that is, that's, this is silver. That, I think I can see a really small marking, but it's hard to tell on that. Earrings, 
What is this? Uh, hmm. It's kind of weird. Okay. <laughs> Let's see, that was down on the bottom. What's in here? Looks like some little charms or something. Let's see. Okay. Let's keep on looking. Definitely haven't hit the mother load on this box. A lot of costume stuff. Maybe a, oh. maybe a little bit. Yeah, we've already looked at that. Let's move it. We've already looked at all that. There is, okay, let's not show that. That's a personal picture. We've got some more boxes down here. Let's see, here's a large box. Gold, silver, minimal accessories. Um, yeah, it looks like, you know, some costume stuff. What do we have here? Is this like Brighton or Pandora or something? Oh, look at it. This is cool. It's a Georgia Bulldog. Look at that um, yeah. pendant. That oh. thing's huge. I wonder if that's silver. Because that thing is big. It looks like it is. It does. Here, set that down, open that up. And we'll look set at that it. down, open that up. So we can see it closer. Because I think that might be silver. And I'll look at some more stuff here. What do we have here? Um, there's the receipt there. I think this is silver. I think that's what it says. Nope, stainless steel, but that's a really nice. It's like brand new little um, cross necklace there. What else do we got? Empty ring box. We got these little funky little boxes here. That's cool. It's got like a little cross and a fish and a heart inside of there. I think it's just costume though. And that one's empty. We're still looking though. The bowl in this bag. That's why I keep going. <laughs> what is this? We got a little half moon or a little crescent moon. I don't see any markings on that right offhand. But like I said, I'm we're looking really quick at this stuff, so there could be some stuff that's potentially so I don't really see anything that looks like it's gold at the moment, but this has a bunch of little pendants. There's a there's a Georgia Bulldog pendant, a little star. I mean, um, charms, charms or pendants. There's a little football player helmet. So what you got there? We got the big pendant here. I don't know if that's silver. It kind of looks like it, it could be. It looks like it. But it's pretty cool looking. Yeah. Um, okay. This is best or something. Here's a little charm or pendant, and that one does. That one is silver right there. The little bulldog. I thought it looked like it. And then we've oh, got a okay. little bracelet here. And I guess another bracelet. But these will do really well in our auction because we're in Georgia and there's a lot of people that be yep. they're gonna go crazy over these right here. Oh well, that's right. Everybody had to get to the game mm -hmm. Saturday. <laughs> so that's a good little this little bag right here probably go go for a pretty decent amount of money. Surprising amount probably. Tacori, everything Tacori is empty, but I think Tacori is like real, real jewelry, I think. Um, 925, that's silver. A little heart pendant and a necklace, it's got a little message on the back. And we're still looking, there's more, some, some of this looks like it could be silver down here, but if not, there's some very nice looking costume stuff. Um, man, it just keeps, there's a lot of jewelry in here. A lot of jewelry here. Put that down. Open them. <laughs> Come on, open stuff for me. Okay, this bottom one here. There's a here's a necklace box we didn't look at. Let's see. Oh, it says silver rhodium plate. If that's okay, let's just open it up and see if that's what's in it. Um. Yeah, I think this is just like a plated napier. This is just costume stuff. But there's different stuff kind of thrown in here. That says Claire's on it, so that's probably nothing. So it looks, looks kind of fancy, but just costume. But some costume can be worth a, you know, worth a good bit. Nice looking bracelet there. Here's a little bag, let's see. Hopefully I'm just, the camera is still on because I'm, I'm getting low on, I think both battery and memory. I think this is silver. This necklace, this is really nice looking. 
Yep, this is sterling silver. Yeah, on the necklace right there, you could tell as soon as you see it. That's very nice looking. What did you see in there? Anything? Oh, Some kind of pendant. Yep, that's cool. I guess that's like a pendant that would. Yeah. And this um, this kind of looks like it's sterling here, but can't quite make out any markings. Mm -hmm. This is the and more probably costume and what do you have in there? Just more. I think that's a locket. Yeah, that's like a locket. Alright, so a lot of nice looking stuff. A couple no gold in here that we saw right offhand or nothing that really looked like gold. Um, but quite a bit of we did find several pieces of silver and there's quite a few things that look like it could have been um um, sterling silver that we didn't really check close, but that's pretty much it. So a lot of jewelry in there, mostly costume, hoping based off the other box we might find some more silver and gold, but just a little bit. But that's pretty much it for this unit. We just gotta load these last few things up here. And very good unit. Um, they, they were an artist, they had tons and tons of paint, tons of paint brushes, um, but other stuff too, good decor, good household stuff, a few, few pieces of furniture, not a whole lot. The really nice cooler, that nice Pelican cooler, you know, and just, you know, some other odds and ends, but paint supplies, craft supplies, um, Christmas decor, home decor, that was the thing in this unit. Very nice cooler here, but that's it. Good unit overall. If you like this video, give us the thumbs up, leave a comment. If you haven't already, if you want to see more videos like this, all the different units we get and everything to do with the resale business, then hit that subscribe button. Y'all have a good one.